remember at the end of the day technology has to adjust to human beings and not the other way around and i always tell our uh, young people a particular story and like it goes like you know saying that there was this great software guru technology phd uh, all the great uh, tech nerds that we have and a really ordinary gujarati from uh, gujarat on a plane both sitting uh, next to each other and this guy is in awe of this guru and says so the guru says ah, i am a technology guy but chalo let's play a game i'll be generous to you that you can ask me one question i'll ask you one question and uh, uh, whoever cannot answer the question if you don't know the question you pay like you pay us and because i am the great technology guru for whatever question i don't know i'll pay you 100 rupees you pay me 10 rupees this poor would you look that this guy and said okay we'll do that like you're a great technology guy so he says uh, okay you start so he said yeah this is the phone on in your hand tell me like in 1969 like for nasa what was the power of the computers and what's the power in your phone and asked him a complicated question this guy said i don't know so he says okay here 10 rupees so he gave him 10 rupees so he took it now fundamentally the guru had to ask the same question so he asked okay he says okay tell me like Uh, what is that animal that climbs a mountain on four legs and comes down on three legs so this software engineer like went down says what is it what is it like went to he took his phone googled everything this is that and said don't know so he took 100 rupees and gave it to the guy uh, this guy took the 100 rupees went to sleep saying no no this is not fair right you have to tell me you just can't go to sleep tell me what the right answer is after all i am the engineer phd and all this stuff so the guru took another 10 rupees and gave it to him says i don't know <laughs> so within this i think that the big lesson that Uh, all of us engineers and tech gurus have to understand that ultimately there is common sense and the power of the common man and technology has to adjust to human beings all our young people have to understand at the end of the day we serve society and we serve that common man and we should always be aware that he is far smarter than each one of us